Good morning. This is Pastor Tim Wells, pastor of Cross of Christ Lutheran Church in Aurora, Nebraska. We have preschool chapel this morning, and today we're going to talk about the feeding of the 5,000. You know, there's a lot of things we could talk about with this lesson. Jesus is out in the wilderness, and suddenly this large crowd finds Jesus. He's trying to get away from the crowd, but they find him. Jesus has compassion on the people. Starts healing everyone. The day goes on. Now it's the end of the day. The disciples are getting worried. There's a huge crowd here, Jesus, and we don't have any food. Everyone's going to get hungry. You need to send everyone home right now while they still have time, while there's still daylight left, so they can get something to eat. And Jesus says, no, you give them something to eat. Disciples say, all we have are five loaves of bread and two small fish. Jesus says, bring them to me, takes the food, blesses it in front of the crowd, gives it back to the disciples, says, now give this to the people. The disciples start distributing the bread and fish. And what do you know, by the time they're done, everyone in the crowd, and this is over 5,000 men plus women and children, so a huge crowd of people, everyone in the crowd has something to eat. But wait, not just something to eat. Everyone in the crowd has enough to eat. But wait, not just enough to eat. Everyone in the crowd is able to eat until they are completely satisfied. Their stomachs are full. They are stuffed. And on top of that, there are 12 baskets of leftovers. When God provides for our needs, he always gives enough. But more than that, he always gives more than enough. Ultimately, pouring his grace, his love, his mercy down on us as he gives us his only son to die on the cross and then rise from the dead three days later to forgive our sins, to win for us the gift of eternal life. In Jesus, we have the greatest of blessings. And we are reminded God always gives more than enough. Let's pray. Lord God, Heavenly Father, Lord, we thank you for your abundant blessings that you pour upon us each and every day. Lord, we especially thank you for the gift of your Son, our Savior, who through his blood shed on the cross has forgiven our sins, and through his own resurrection has won for us the gift of eternal life. Lord, let us always be able to recognize and thank you for the many blessings that you give us. In your name we pray. Amen. I pray God's blessings on your day. And remember, God always gives more than enough. Amen.